the man, his son, and the donkey. A man and his son were going to town. They wanted their donkey to look fit and well, so they could sell him for a good price. Riding him would have made the donkey tired, so they walked behind him, one after the other. They met some old women standing by the roadside. Look at that! They said. What a thoughtless man to let his poor son trudge along the dusty road when there is a perfectly good donkey to ride on. Let your poor son ride," said the old women. The man thought it would please the old women if he did what they told him. Otherwise, they might think he was thoughtless. So the son rode on the donkey, and the man walked in front. The man was well pleased to have taken such good advice. Soon, they met some old men sitting by the roadside. "Look at that," said the old man. "What a selfish boy! He's riding the donkey while his old father is trudging along the dusty road." The old man said. Let your poor father ride. The son did not want the old man to think him selfish, so he did what they told him. So the man rode in the donkey, and the son walked in front. The son was well pleased to have taken such good advice. After a while, they met some workmen by the roadside. Look at that! The workman said, laughing. <laughs> What a crazy pair! A donkey is made for two people to ride on, yet the boy is trudging along the dusty road. You should both ride on that donkey," said the workman. The man did not want the workman to think he was crazy, so the man and his son both rode on the donkey. The donkey was getting tired. Under the double weight and stumbled from time to time as he trudged along. Some children were playing by the roadside. Look at that! They said, "What cruel people! They are both riding on that poor donkey who keeps stumbling along. It should be the other way round. Let the poor donkey ride," said the children. However, could the donkey ride? Wondered the man, but he thought he should please the children. So he decided that somehow he and his son would have to carry the donkey. They got off, and the only way the man could think of was to tie the donkey's legs together over a pole. So the man and his son carried the donkey on a pole. When they came to the town, everybody laughed at them. Look at that! They cried. Have you ever seen anything like it? They must be quite mad to carry a donkey on a pole. The donkey did not like this, and he kicked at the pole. He hated all that noise and was tired of hanging upside down. The man and his son were just crossing a bridge over a river when the donkey started to kick. He kicked so hard that the pole broke. And the donkey fell into the river. Splash! And the man and his son fell into the river too. Splash! Splash! What a calamity! All three splashing helplessly about in the water. And all because the man and his son had tried too hard to please everyone, and in the end had pleased no one. The end.